good morning everyone welcome to this quick video uh, this is specially for my subscribers uh, I just wanted to give you guys one security update uh, Palo Alto they just received they just released uh, one critical vulnerability and since this is a border device if you're using one of those please evaluate and and evaluate the risk and if you need to apply patches please go ahead and apply the patches in your own schedule so this is the CV ID, CV 2020-2040, and it's related to the PAN OS system uh, and buffer overflow. So I'm just going to go to their website real quick, and I'm going to give you this link uh, in my video. So if you go to that site, you'll find all the information that you need. Uh, first thing that you need to look at is the severity. It's 9.8, and you know that the CVS is the highest maximum possible stand. So this is very, very high severity vulnerability, and they are rating it as critical. Okay, uh, attack complexity is low. So if you know how to how to attack, you probably will be able to exploit this vulnerability. Okay, privilege required is none. This is unbelievable. You don't even need any high privilege account. To exploit this vulnerability user interaction is none so I feel like this is you know one of the critical vulnerabilities that you should really really take a look at uh, if you look at the confidential integrity and availability impact is high for all three of them now the first thing that I would I would like you guys to take a look at is the affected version if, if you have any of these versions uh, and if you are using pan OS system uh, then if it's less than 9.1.3 or less than 9.0.9 .9 or these versions you are affected so make sure that if you're in this category unaffected version 10 or 9.13 uh, more than greater than 9.09 .09 and 8.1.15 then you're fine so read through this okay here is your solution it's simple and uh, all Prismax is upgraded so you probably just need to apply the patch and uh, just read through it and if you look at what you, what what is this vulnerability is all about it's about a buffer overflow vulnerability in the PAN operating system that allows an unauthenticated attacker to disrupt system processes and potentially execute arbitrary code with root privileges okay so that's that doesn't look very good uh, to the CAPT portal or multi-factor authentication interface so this needs to be enabled so if you're not using the multi-factor authentication interface you may be okay but again read through it make sure that you are not affected and take action that's all I wanted to say today uh, stay safe and just before I close if you look at today's security advisory there are a whole bunch others that also got released uh, but this one is the most critical one okay this is the one that you should definitely pay attention to but since you are there take a look at couple others as well uh, like reflected cross-site scripting vulnerability that's also important uh, to me as well all right thank you stay safe have a great day